Today's video is going to be a nice and easy one. In fact, this is a guide in how you can get yourself a pet in Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. Yes, on the planet of Bogano, you can find a pet, Bogling. For those who do not know, the Bogling is the creature you see prancing about and hiding in these holes that hide when you get too close. Obviously, they're native to Bogano, hence the name Bogling. Now, this is incredibly easy as it's literally right below where your ship is landed. So, to the right of the landing pad, you will find a path that leads down into this cave. You will need the Force Push ability in order to obtain this Bogling companion, so if you haven't got that, continue playing through the story and then come back to Bogano once you have it. Anyways, in this little tunnel, this is what you will find. Hey there, little guy. Obviously, this is where you're going to want to use force push on the panels that are covering this doorway. We'll find you a home. This is where it will tell you that you have acquired a Boggling Companion. The game will then give you a prompt telling you that you've gained a Boggling Stowaway and you should look around the Mantis to catch a glimpse of your new friend. And provided you're deep enough into the story, you will acquire this trophy slash achievement. Now let's head back to the Mantis. Now I found the Boggling on board the ship in three places. In this air vent here, the air vent parallel to it across on the other side of the ship, and hiding beneath the holo table. Now, if you look for too long or get too close, our new friend will scurry off and hide somewhere else. I think those are the only three spots that he moves between, so he'll always be in one of those spots, and you can't really interact with it. That being said, Boglings are shy creatures, so what did you expect? Furthermore, Cal is the only character who is actually aware of the Bogling being on board. Though, as suggested by an in-flight conversation, the rest of the crew are somewhat aware, they just do not know that it is a Bogling. Anyone else hear that weird noise earlier? No, I didn't hear anything. But my meditation helps me focus out many distractions. I don't know, it's not a normal sound the Mantis makes. It sounded like it came from inside, too. Like a stowaway? <laughs> They'd have to be pretty small breeds. This ship isn't that big. Maybe, or it could be. I have been missing some food lately. Smells. Oh, droid smell? Not that I'm aware of. And they definitely don't eat. Uh, all right, I'll do more investigating. If I find something, I'll let you know. Can't wait. So in order to survive being a stowaway, our boggling friend has started stealing food. Stowaway is probably a better word to use for this guy than companion, however the game refers to him as a boggling companion. That being said, I haven't really put to the test whether or not he accompanies you when you're away from the ship, though I'd imagine he does not. As a little bit of extra detail, down where you can find this boggling to the right as opposed to the doorway on the left where you find him, you can push this orb into a little slot which opens the door and you can get yourself a health stim canister which increases your health stim capacity by one, so it's very useful. And I guess that concludes today's guide into how to find a boggling companion in Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. Do you reckon I could have worded that in a way that made it seem like I didn't make a guide for this every single day? Another day, another guide for the exact same thing. But I suppose that does in fact conclude today's video. I've been working hard on a Red Dead video and I don't know when that will be done, so this was just a good little fun video for me to put up in between. Hopefully you guys enjoyed, and if not, hopefully it was helpful in helping you find a boggling companion, because everybody wants one of those little guys. So thank you all for watching, I hope you enjoyed. Be sure to go ahead, leave a like, subscribe, share the channel with your friends and all that wonderful stuff, that would be really appreciated. Maybe consider becoming a patron as well to get all that succulent extra content. Whether or not you think it's worth it is completely up to you, of course. And I will see you all very soon with another video at some point.